Hey friends, welcome back. So back at the end of June, I moved into this apartment and last month, I believe, I finally got all the furniture in here. I finally got all my decorations hung up, set up, everything. So now I'm finally gonna give you a tour. So here is the setup from outside. I bought these, I don't even know where at, so I'm sorry for that. Um, here's the rug I put in front of my door. This cat has ripped it to shreds. Thank you, Meow Meow, for doing nothing. You did amazing, sweetie. So here's my front door, it's really dirty, love it. <laughs> All right, so here's the view when you first walk in. So to the left you have my kitchen table. It is hella big. My living room, my kitchen, and my laundry area. So funny story about my laundry area. Um, it's actually not big enough. Or, or like if I had got like a sit down washer and dryer, it wouldn't be big enough to close the door. So me and my mom had the bright idea to get a stackable washer and dryer and you know what's funny about that when you close the doors they still don't shut all the way so we love what they did with the place we love it that's just one of the many things i love about this apartment but yeah in here we've got i built oh just kidding maddie built that my friend built that because i am not an engineer i do not know how to build stuff we got my hamper, we got the shelf that I had to take down because the stack wool washer is too big. That's the only place I could fit my clothes basket because, again, I don't have a lot of space, but it is fine. All right, here's the kitchen area. It's really small. I bought this from Ikea, all of it. Got all the cute pictures of me and my friends and stuff. Cute. I don't have nothing in these baskets and I don't plan on hanging nothing in these baskets because, you know. Here is my kitchen. Yeah. Cute. I got this for from somewhere last Christmas time. Kind of cute or whatever. Little microwave. You know. Just the basics. Um, I really don't have any, you know, groceries or anything because your boy is broke. <laughs> so like, if you want to cash at me, that would totally be appreciated. There's literally nothing in here besides ketchup ranch and tortillas. So that's always fun. If you want to cash at me to help me out, I'll put my cash tag in the description. And if you don't use Cash App, well, guess what, baby? I got, I got Venmo, I got PayPal, I got Zelle. So the in, I don't discriminate when it comes to getting paid. So like, I'll put all those nice little usernames in my description. Okay, so here's my kitchen table and my living area. Kind of cute or whatever. My friend painted me these for me. She did really good. They're kind of crooked, but like, we ain't gonna get into all that. Okay. These pillows, the pumpkin ones, I stole from my mom. Should to go buy new ones because I'm kind of a thief. Klepto tings. Um. Here's the rug. I hope y'all like the rug. I've gotten really good compliments about the rug because it's cute or whatever. Here's the entertainment center. It says boo. It's lit up and it's not looking good right now. But. All right, yeah. I got that from Target, I think. I'm not really sure. But. Look at this cute little like Buddha fountain I got. It worked for a little bit. And then, well, I got it from Five Below. That's why it don't work. But it worked for about 30 minutes and then it stopped working. So 
I truly love it, you know. Here is my kitchen table. Um, there's also a pack of Calvin Klein underwear in the floor for whatever reason. I'm so sorry for y'all that y'all had to see that. So we're just gonna quickly go over. But yeah, here's my kitchen table. It shrinks in the middle so it can get smaller. It's really big, I <laughs> love it, but yes. Back here is all my bedrooms and my bathroom. Right here is a hole that they were supposed to fix whenever I moved in. But you know what they didn't fix? They didn't fix the hole, so I super duper love it. My favorite spot in the entire apartment is that hole. Yeah, there's also like one right here and you know, one right here and some paint chips, but it just adds flavor to the apartment. Here's my bathroom. She little, but she pretty. Um, yeah, so I've gotten a really bad. Everybody has just called me a middle aged white woman because I put that on the back of my toilet. If your duties be crazy, please use the spray. How is that middle aged? Like, what? I'm sorry, okay? I'm sorry. Dang. Here's the little closet that's in my bathroom and there's all my flushable wipes fun fact really sad fact I started using flushable wipes in 2017 and then I've never went back I literally don't ever use toilet paper ever I've had this toilet paper in my apartment since I moved in in June because I don't use it when I went on that month trip to Europe I literally bought like seven I literally brought like seven packages of Flush wipes because I refuse to use toilet paper. So this toilet, this roll right here has lasted me for about a month now because I don't ever use it. But you know, it's whatever. Here is my extra bedroom. Um, here's my old bed for, that I just brought from my house because I bought a new one whenever I moved. Um, yeah, she kind of cute or whatever. I bought this painting because I thought it would go good with the vines on the other side of the room. I bought that from Target. I can't tell you how many times it's fell down. Love it. And here's all the vines that I hung up. I ran out right there, but like, you know, I'm moving in like three months. So like, what's the point in fixing it now, you know? But yeah, she kind of cute or whatever. Big boobs? What? Um, child. Anyway, so. Here's a butt painting that me and Maddie did. Well, Maddie painted my butt and I just sat down. So it was really all Maddie. My mom disowned me after that. So. Oh my God. Is this who we are? Is this what we represent? Here's this cute mirror I bought from Urban Outfitters. Yeah, it stands up. There's some paintings back there, but we're gonna ignore that. It has these hooks that you're, I don't know really what you're supposed to hook it on, but I put my bracelets and rings and keys right there. This closet has like all my winter stuff and like dress shirts and just a bunch of random junk up there. I got all my shoes on a rack because that's just how it be. <clears throat> and here is my bedroom. I hope y'all like my heat bed because I sure do. So here's my Frank Ocean tapestry. It took like a month and a half to come in, but I love it. You know, um, here's my bed. I got it from Hank's Fine Furniture. You know, I don't know if that's just like a local business or like a nationwide, but 
But anyway, yeah, there's supposed to be lights that go in these two holes right here. But they still haven't came in. It's been four months. They still haven't came in because they've been on a back order. We truly love it, you know. Here's my side table because, you know, yeah. Here's this cute painting that I've had for like a while now. I had it in my old room. You've probably seen it in past videos. Um, yeah, these are really probably uneven, but like, again, like I said, I'm moving in three months, so I'm definitely not gonna go through all of that just to move, so. But yeah, I got this at Five Below. You can kind of see where it's kind of like dented and like chipped and stuff, but hey. It came at a good price, so. I got this from, oh, let me. I got this when I went to New York in 2019. I got it from a little like booth in Central Park. It's cute or whatever. Um, here is my walk-in closet. Love it. I have a lot of sh crap in here. I've had these boxes in here for like, I moved in too lazy to do anything with them so but yes I hope you guys enjoyed my apartment I'm only gonna be here till the end of December because I am moving to California you know I'm gonna look for apartments a month from now so wish me luck kids I'll be in this apartment till my six month lease is up and I'm getting the hell out of here. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed.